They rented out the place for me. Come on now, yeah, you know I'm gonna do it, baby. <laughs> <laughs> They not god they god brothers too they god brothers. but they cousins right. <laughs> hey y'all so it's jerry and i's anniversary excuse to shake in the road is very bummy our anniversary is a little different this year we got little nuggets three years down forever to go we're gonna wear the smoke bomb i love that barbecue food Smoky bones. Oh, smoky bones. I love their barbecue food. He's asleep right now. Hopefully he stays asleep the whole time. Because it's is his um, nap time. Well, he's really asleep. Time. They rented out the place for me. Come on now. Yeah, you know I'm going to do it, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Ain't nobody in there, bitch. <laughs> Morning, sweet punchy. <laughs> he real nosy, honey. He just woke up. He wakes up around 7. I'm feeding him his bottle. He a little congested. So I got the little freedom mom over there going on. And his hatch machine. See, like those um, sound on his hatch machine. So, all of that's going on. I'm going to show y'all. But, excuse my little setup. But, yeah, got that going on. Feeding him his babas. Then, I'm going to put his on. Um, my mama actually coming over here today to watch him. So, this morning would be good. So after he get done with his bottle, I'm gonna burp him. I'm gonna change his clothes, oil him down, and then I'm gonna go downstairs 
I'm gonna have to get his bottles ready. So I put it in the picture. So all this she had to do was just pour it in his bottle. Yeah. That's what we're gonna do. So he just sits here while I put my clothes on. Yeah. You be good boy. So I'm good boy. So I'm good boy. I'm good boy, Papa. Sound like he's on boo boo. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, boobos. Yeah, boobos. Stinky man. Stinky, stinky, stinky man. Grandma, okay. <laughs> yeah. You got your little sloth outfit on. Let me put a pet pad right here. <laughs> Done. He got his little sloth outfit on. Look at so cute. Mm -hmm. Let's head on out, stinky pants. You spitting teeth. Yeah. Okay. So I packed his bag the night before. It's bottles, clean onesies, clean sleepers, all that in them. And we're about to go. We're all set. We're ready to go. Let me bring your little toy right here. You like it on your left side. You can have something to play with. Bring that down. And put Pepe in your mouth. He may, he may sit it out because he love to talk. But here, get Pepe. Suck on Pepe. You here, Papas? You gonna be good boy? You gonna be good boy? You gonna be good boy? 
You scratched your face real bad. You're going to be a good boy. Say yes. Hey, y'all. So I'm about to give Bubbles a bath. What you looking at, Bub? Huh? Look at this little neck. Say hey. So I'm about to get him a um, bath. Start your little night routine. I got his bottle already. Something to do, just give you a little bath. I think he's teething a little bit too. It may be a little early, I don't know, but I feel like he's teething. Cause the drool is insane. Cause the drool started at two months, he's three months now. And the biting on the fence like they'll chick him on is absurd. He love the camera. But yeah, so let me go ahead and run his bath water. Then y'all show him how we get your bath. Yeah. Say hey. Say hey, Bubby. You like your bath, Bubby. You like your bath. You like your bath, you get your feet. Say, I love the bath, mama. Say, I love it. I'm big boy. I'm big boy. Got him all dressed and greased down. He, he ready to eat. And he just, you know how the kids, when you take them to the pool, you take them out of the water, they show up. That's how he is when it's, when he get out that bath, baby. He he want to stay in and he just get fussy. Yeah, I'm talking about you, sir. So, <laughs> yeah, I'm going to feed him his bubba and get ready for bed. Put his little silk do-rag on. And yeah, let's go eat, eat. This is little silk, little hat. His daddy bought him from Amazon. Gonna put it on him. Feed him his baba. He over it. He ready to eat. Okay, boo boo. <laughs> I know y'all probably like, girl, why you take your work clothes off? It was a late day. Then this shirt is different than what y'all seen me in earlier because he threw up on me. So I just put this shirt on. But when I come home, baby, I get him together. It takes a little minute. I get myself together, get my stuff ready for work, and I go to bed. And then today it started off a little late because Jared needed me to get him um, when I got off of work. And I get off later than Jared, so they kind of pushed me back. And I sat down and talked to my mama for a little while before I got on the road. But, yeah, they pushed us back. So, yeah. And then, yeah, he threw up on my shirt, so that's why I have a different shirt on than earlier. And I know that shirt was big. I look like somebody auntie, but don't I, I like mm, don't don't come for me, okay? The shirt was eleven dollars. It's actually my size, but just give auntie. But yeah, yeah, bubbies. Good morning. Good morning, Bubba. Relax. You try to sit up so bad. <laughs> Jackson, just lay there. Lay. Come on, let go. Let me stop playing. <laughs> lay back. Lay back. Only three months, Papa. Relax. That's pretty much what we do. Usually we be usually we be out the house about seven sometimes, but it's seven twelve. So just hopefully we leave out the house about you know later than seven forty. 
I'll be to work on time so I can drop him off because it takes about with traffic it takes about 30 minutes to get to my mom's house so I just changed him he's finishing his ball ball then we'll be I'm gonna burp him then we'll be on the road hope y'all like this little <laughs> get ready with me and baby work little thing little majid try to do something different honey but yeah let me know if y'all want to see more of these videos i know it's not much that i do to get him out the house but yeah just drop in the comments below what y'all want to see next when i tell y'all i'm super late today Baby boy done boo booed up his bed so freaking bad today, it don't make no sense. Soon as I buckle him into his car seat, I hear burr, 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 and I'm like, oh my God, Justin, mind you, if I leave out at 740, I'll be there, you know, I can get the work and drop him off at my mom's house in a decent time. It's currently eight o'clock. Hopefully I get there at nine, no later than 910. But it's just, it's one of those mornings. It's one of those mornings. It's very unpredictable with that baby. That's why I tell Jared, you have it good. You got the pickup shift. So you just, you getting off of work, you want to pick him up. I'm dropping him off. So I have to try to get out the house at a decent time because sometimes he don't want a bottle. He want to get, he can get in his seat. We turn up, we lit, we gone. Most days he just want to be held for a long period of time, he don't want to go in his car seat right away. Then another time, he boo boo or he throw up on his thing. So it's just a lot. You never know. You just you, you just never know. You just never know. You just never know. But yeah, I just had to come in and say that about y'all little nephew. Well, moving. That's cute. 